when you study it, and if you can be open-minded, you can really come to see the, the beauty uh, in this new music. And then when you go back to look at old music, when you go back to look at Mozart and Bach again, you look at it with fresh, fresh ears. Audiences listen differently in different countries. What I've noticed here in Russia, um, for instance, at the end of the Ligeti, the chamber concerto, in the score, there's a, um, there's a rallentando. The music slows down. There's a little, a little flutter from the celeste, a flutter from the organ, and a flutter from the clarinet. And then in the score, there's a fermata, and it says 15 seconds. So I wait, and I stop for 15 seconds. I'm counting. One, two, three. And during that time, listening to the decay of the sound, and then listening to the audience listen, and then you let the silence go, and they begin to clap. And you know that they've experienced something. At the end, like we got a standing ovation, the Russians were like clapping to like a just for beat, and it's just it was just really cool. When something's appreciated, the audience begins to clap in a in a rhythmic fashion. They just won't stop, and they keep calling you back again and again. And that was very special that that happened with this this kind of programming with these students. We actually had to leave the stage before the audience started clapping, and that's the sign of a very, very fine performance. It was great. It that's was the best one part. of the best, <laughs> best feelings we've Everyone had just hugged show. everyone. It was just a hugging fest. It was just <laughs> such a great bonding experience, and yeah. just being so close to everyone so quickly is just amazing. No, yeah, I got more nervous than I have in a long time, and it, it all worked out well, so that, that's, that's a very reassuring feeling to have as a musician. It doesn't really feel like the faculty and student collaboration is some uh, extraordinary thing, and yet it is. We put so much time and effort into all the rehearsals, and this was the goal we were trying to reach, and yeah. I think everyone just played their best. You know, it's, it really is an honor um, to be involved with this and, and to have this opportunity. It's just really inspiring to know that in the future we could be one of these great performers. I think what it comes down to is that Ithaca College trains professionals. Mm -hmm. 